On this episode, we are going to be checking out the entire Memo Bottle range. We'll compare all the sizes and let's see which one suits you best. Coming right up. Hey, what's up guys? This is Jin from Oribags and on this channel, we are all about coming up with product videos and tips to help you carry better. So if this is your first time watching, please hit that subscribe button, you know where it is, and turn on that bell button too. And if you're already a subscriber, welcome back to our channel. So this is the first of a two-part episode for Memo Bottles. Today, we're going to be checking out all the bottles right here, the entire bottles range. And in part two, stay tuned for that, we will take a look at some of the accessories that complement the Memo Bottle. I'll put up the links below and on the tab right here once it's ready. So what is a Memo Bottle and what is so special about it? Well. The Memo Bottle is a premium, reusable, flat water bottle. Now those are the keywords right there that you need to know. But the main word that answers what's so special about it is definitely its flat design. I mean, when I first saw the Memo Bottle, I thought the design was brilliant. So this flat water bottle is designed to fit where other water bottles don't, basically. So, which is inside your bag, alongside your computer, your laptop, your books, uh, your iPad, and other valuables as well. But that's not all, really. So if you stay with me throughout the entire video, I'll take you through um, the product range, and I'll also give you the pros and cons of each Memo bottle, but mostly pros. So the ultimate goal, basically, is to challenge how we as a society consume water and the effects single-use water bottles have on our environment. That's why the co-founders of Memo Bottle created this brilliantly shaped water bottle to make it as easy as possible for you to carry it wherever you go. No more excuses, right? All right then, let's take a look at the entire collection, shall we? Okay, so I've got all the bottles lined up here and I've got the accessories in another side and that's for another video, all right? Oh my God, these are so, so pretty. So now let's just take a quick uh, look at the packaging, okay? Now, each Memo bottle is packaged beautifully in these uh, premium boxes. You can really hear the quality of these boxes. And these make such beautiful gifts for all occasions, birthdays, Christmas, you name it. And so let's zoom in on the details on the packaging. All right, so now that we have unboxed everything, let me just take you through a very quick highlight over here. As you might have already noticed, each Memo bottle comes equipped with a black and a white lid right here, okay? So except for the slim Memo bottle, which is paired with a stainless steel lid. So now this is a very thoughtful gesture. Just in case you lose one, at least you have a spare right here. So I've got the entire range here. Let me introduce you to these Memo bottles. I've got the A7, A6, A5, and this is the Slim Memo bottle. Now, the one thing that really captured my attention is, of course, its award-winning design, the attention to detail, and the names of the bottles. If you haven't already noticed or if you haven't already figured it out, these are the dimensions of international paper sizes. But considering that the Slim Memo bottle is not a paper size, let's just give you the dimensions and capacity comparisons anyway.
So this brings us back again to the problem of fitting conventional bulgy water bottles into our bags, our slings, or even our backpacks for example, and the solution that memo bottles offer. Or if you're carrying a bag that just doesn't come with any bottle holder, what do you do, right? So memo bottle really solves that problem. Its shape is designed to kind of look and feel like the stationery that we carry. So check this out, okay? So when you carry it around, it feels really natural. And this really optimizes the way that we carry. So whether for travel, for the office, uh, for on-campus life, for example, the memo bottle is truly made for our convenience and to really encourage us to make it part of our EDC, our everyday carry, and something that we cannot leave home without. All right, so let's zoom in on the material, all right? So each memo bottle is crafted with the highest quality BPA and BPS-free plastic. And if you're wondering, why plastic? Well, long story short, plastic is environmentally sustainable as long as it's being reused. Makes sense, right? So when considering the amount of carbon footprint used from getting the raw material right down to the final product, reusable plastic bottles are apparently 80% more environmentally friendly than stainless steel, glass and aluminum alternatives. Memo bottles are also freezer friendly, which is fantastic and you don't find many uh, plastic bottles that can actually do that. And being freezer friendly is really perfect for hot and humid weather like the ones that we have here in Malaysia, as you know, tropical country. 365 days of hot and it can also take hot liquids up to 100 degrees Celsius or 212 degrees Fahrenheit. Now if you're planning to add hot water, I highly recommend that you use a silicone sleeve as it provides some sort of insulation and it protects your hands from of course the heat from the bottle. So don't forget to check out part 2 uh, for a review on all the accessories for Memo Bottle including the silicone sleeves. So it says here in their description that you can add a vitamin boost with every sip by placing a few blueberries and strawberries inside. So I can just totally imagine how this would really look like. It looks so pretty uh, in a transparent bottle with blueberries and strawberries floating inside. But you know what? This sounds great and looks pretty and all, but the practical person in me will start wondering how am I supposed to get all the fruits out once I'm done with the water? I mean, seriously, the mouthpiece over here is really, is really quite small, right? It's really quite small. So if I'm adding blueberries and strawberries inside, yeah, maybe I have to cut it really small. If not, I will probably, I'm guessing you might need some tweezers just to get the fruits or mint leaves out once you're done, which is a bit of a hassle for me. But you know, I love the, I like, I still like the novelty of it. All right, so now let me take you through all the memo bottles one by one. Okay, let's walk through all of them. Let's start with the A7 bottle. Now this is the smallest of all the memo bottles, this is such an adorable size. It's so, so cute. Um, I love the A7 bottle. It's really such an adorable size. It kind of reminds me of a whiskey flask, right? And you can easily slip this into your pocket, into your sling bag. Uh, and for ladies, you can even put it in a little pouch or a clutch that you're carrying around with you. Um, and honestly, for me, I'm a camel. Okay, I'm a camel. I drink a lot of water. So I will literally finish all of the water in this A7 bottle in just one gulp, right? I can do it. Now, while this is cute, I don't think it's really for me, but let me just show you what a ninja this little bottle can be. Alright, so let's move on to the A6 
bottle. Now I've got, as you can see, I've gone ahead and added some water inside here just to give you a very nice visual effect of how the bottle will look like with liquid inside. It's really quite mesmerizing. <laughs> Work of art, right? <laughs> now the A6 is the best selling size. I would say, I think many people find it uh, very practical. Uh, the capacity is 375 ml, which is equivalent to 12 ounces. Now this size, um, I would say is decent enough to keep you hydrated. Uh, when you're heading out to the mall or wherever and small enough to fit inside your sling bag or even your handbag and you can really see how well it fits into your bag and now we move on to the a5 bottle now the a5 is the largest of all the memo bottles yes i've gone ahead and added water into this as well it's really very nice <laughs> i'm really quite mesmerized by it so the a5 memo bottle has a 750 ml capacity which is equivalent to 25 ounces and i would say the a5 memo bottle is more for serious drinking like you're going to be out the entire day and as I, as I mentioned earlier, it's the largest of all the bottles over here. And with its 750 ml capacity, this A5 memo bottle would allow you to kind of stay focused and be more productive the entire day. So it's really perfect for office use, for on-campus use. So imagine you're at a seminar or in a lecture and if you've got one of those really tiny stowaway tables and the memo bottle is perfect because you don't need to put your water bottle on the floor um, or you know put it on the table the small table and accidentally tipping it off the table because it's so tiny. So this memo bottle is perfect because it lays down flat together with your stationery, together with your notebook and you know in small tiny spaces you can even put your notebook on top of the memo bottle and just take notes on it anyway and last but not least let's move on to the slim memo bottle now the slim memo bottle in my opinion is the most elegant of them all it's long it's slender it's beautiful uh, it comes paired with this stainless steel uh, lid over here the shape and the feel of a memo holding a slim memo bottle is supposed to mimic how you would hold your mobile phone it's how your mobile phone will fit in your hands so let me just take my iPhone XR over here I'm just gonna put it here and there you go the exact same size of a iPhone XR and it's beautiful shaped beautifully fits in beautifully now it's uniquely slim profile allows it to comfortably slide into most compact spaces like your backpack your um, messenger bag your office bag your handbag even your tote bag and it's really very very aesthetically pleasing uh, to me I think this could be my favorite I don't know but uh, more importantly this slim memo bottle remains a very practical product and allowing you to stay productive, stay hydrated at the same time and stylish too. Alright, so now that we've seen all the memo bottles, I've got something special to show you guys. I'm sure some of you might be wondering if memo bottles can actually stand on its own. Let me just show you. Okay, I've got the A7 here. The A6. The slim, oh, this is gonna be, this is gonna be tough. Oh, it can, it can, it can. <laughs> and the A5. Ta da! Now, according to Memo Bottle, I've got the description right here. It says here that Memo Bottles are designed to stand up unassisted. However, given the geometry of the bottles, they aren't quite as stable as traditional round and cylindrical water bottles. They are, however, quite stable on their side when sitting on a flat surface. Our bottles are also more stable when filled with liquid. All right, so it says here that it's a lot more stable. So it's not very stable like this because, you know, as you know, the geometry of and, and the design of the bottle, it's not very stable. But it says here that it's a lot more stable when it's on its side. So let's just flip them over. And there you have it. Not bad, eh? <laughs> Pretty stable. I like this experiment. And it's true, it's a lot more stable when it's filled with water. 
Now, another question that we received when we first brought in Memo Bottle to Oribags was, can I put alcohol into my Memo Bottle? Now, remember what I said earlier, this reminds me of a whiskey flask, right? So <laughs> there you have it. And the answer is yes, you can put um, alcohol into a Memo Bottle. It is safe. However, uh, the bottle is designed primarily for water, but it is still safe for alcohol. So just remember a rule of thumb that if you're going to put any other liquid other than water into your memo bottle, you just need to remember that you need to rinse it out and do a bit more cleaning. What about carbonated drinks? Can I put fizzy drinks in here? Can I put beer in here? Can I put soft drinks in here? Unfortunately, the answer is no. This is not recommended because the pressure that's created from the carbonation can cause the bottle to expand. I think it's due to the, slen the slim shape of the bottle and the carbonation will cause the bottle to expand and damage or alter the shape of the bottle. And that's it for part one of the Memo Bottles range. I hope you found this video useful and that you've managed to even decide which of these Memo Bottles suits you best. Now don't forget to check out part two as I take you through the Memo Bottles accessories, right? Now remember, if you'd like to get your hands on these Memo Bottles, you can visit us at oribags.com. We are from Malaysia. And lastly, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more product videos like this. And I'll see you guys in part two. Bye!